Welcome back to Ozark's Fox AM. It's time to toss it over to Kaylee, who has today's health news and the importance of knowing CPR. Kaylee? That's right. Bystander CPR saved this guy's life nearly 10 years after a heart attack. You won't believe what Bobby Ballard is still doing. Uh, when I had just turned 50, I weighed over 300 pounds, and I said, you know, I'm not going to be around long, so something had to change. A new resolution for a healthier lifestyle was exactly what Bobby Ballard set out to accomplish. Fast food turned into home-cooked meals, walking turned into running, and then in one moment, his entire life was on the line. In April 2011, I'd finished up three miles, went back to my car, got a bottle of water. We sit around and talk after we get done with uh, a run, and um, that's the last thing I remember for eight days. Bobby had a massive heart attack, but lucky for Bobby, an angel was there to save him. Had a nurse that happened to be in my running class, and uh, she had not been coming. She'd missed a bunch of times, and she said, for some reason, you know, I just knew I needed to, you know, get back to running. Gave me CPR. And uh, she gave me CPR until the EMTs got there. Rushed to the hospital. They had defibrillated me or shocked my heart seven times on the way to the hospital, which is an excessive amount. They don't normally do that much, but uh, they said my heart was beating. It just wasn't beating correctly. The odds were stacked against him. ER doctors looked at me and said, he doesn't stand a chance. So they said, you know, get your family together. We're going to try and keep him, try to keep myself alive until you can get all your family together. Just to get my, you know, my final, all my uh, affairs in order. Because they said, you know, we're going to try and have me hang on just until in the morning. Because they weren't sure they could, you know, keep me, uh, you know, going until then. But Bobby's cardiologist believed in second chances, putting in a heart stent and later taking a vein out of his leg to perform a successful triple bypass surgery. Five weeks after triple bypass, I walked in my very first 5K. And the running didn't stop there. 200, probably over 200 races and uh, many 5Ks, 10Ks, half marathons and eight full marathons now. One thing's for sure, he's grateful to be alive. You talk about blessed. I'm, I'm blessed every day when I get up. Bobby says he never thought he'd make it to 60, but he did. Every year he goes back to his cardiologist with his latest medal from running, and his cardiologist wears it around the office and brags about him, of course. Um, he also takes out, um, or whenever he sees his CPR savior um, at a restaurant, he buys the family that meal. Oh, that's oh. fantastic. The least he can do. So. He's looking good. Yeah. He's looking he, great. He says he's keeping running, you know, at 60. Muscles don't work the same as they used to. <laughs> yeah. But a he's slower. Yeah. He's, he's very thankful he can keep running. That's awesome. I love that. Well, I mean, any kind of exercise is really great. Um, yeah. Some people love to run, some people don't love to run, but get out there and do something. Yep. Eight marathons, eight, eight, too. So. Eight marathons. He's done a lot. <laughs> That's eight more than I've run. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, say more than I'm ever going to run. Kaylee, I was telling you off camera earlier, my mom did the same thing. My mom works at a YMCA, and she saved a man's life who had a heart attack. And every year on that, on that date, he sends her flowers. So yeah. it, you're very appreciative of yeah. that person. Who, and thank the Lord my mom knows CPR. I mean, think of all the hugs you get. Think of all the conversations yeah. you get. Um, beyond the, the time that you were supposed to die. Yeah. Yeah. So it's, it's like this cool. bonus time. Yeah. Bonus exactly. Time. A little we're more all thankful. on bonus time, yep. really. Yeah. Thanks. Kaylee. You're welcome. All right. We'll be back right after this. Stay tuned. What did we learn? Uh, 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 uh,